The Grand Rapids Comic Con took a trip roughly 45 minutes south this weekend down to the Kalamazoo Expo Center for a three-day spring fling event. We caught up with some people who say this type of thing is about more than costumes, but rather a sense of community. There's a sense of excitement in the air. This is our 14th show. And show number 14 is off to a great start, though the location has had to change. The Delta Plex closing, we were sort of homeless with this smaller show, needed to find a place to go. This place working out just fine for the 9,000 or so guests who came, dressed to the nines. I have a wonderful staff who made it very easy. That was not true 10, that was not true seven years ago, but it is now, so. I'm blessed. It's an event for all ages. Sixth grader JC and kindergartner Cecilia are proof of that. It's like the one day where you can cut like three days. You can just come and express yourself, be who you are, meet other people that are like you, and even just make friends. People spend hours on their costumes and look forward to meeting others who love the same things they do. I've been doing cons for Probably um, probably about 15 years now. Douglas Peterson dressed as a Jedi with a costume that took a fair amount of creativity to make. I made this all myself. Belt is actually an old suitcase. Saying over the years, he's made lasting friendships from the event. Honestly, it's the people. This is such a good, like, good energy to it. Such, you, know, you, you take one step in. You just feel that, you feel that kind of positive positivity to it. The guest list featuring famous voices in person, like the voice of Jimmy Neutron. Other guests include voices of characters from Dragon Ball Z, Teen Titans, and more. The event that was only supposed to go for one year, now signed on for the next three. And originally it was just planned as a one shot, and well, the community liked it, and the building liked it, and we liked it. If you liked what you saw there, Grand Rapids Big Comic Con event is scheduled for November 15th to 17th. Tickets will be available soon.